Hi, this is Adam from Small Town Machine Shop. And today, I know it's pretty busy, but I need to process and floss and order any of my stuff. So that you, I'd bring it along to show you what I ordered. Now, this one I already opened. Show you the kind of stuff I typically buy. This one. Mostly brake cleaner. I go through a lot of brake cleaner. And yours is pretty competitively priced. The rest of this box is a uh, dark machinery gray paint. For future projects. Okay, set that guy down. Should move here, see what's in this box. Then, what I tend to do is every, every other month, month or so, I try to increase my capabilities as it were. So some of that stuff in this order is going to be for that. These are just going to be three more empty of these and that's what's in this big box down here it's another one of these four drawer things so this will go here and the drawers will go in there an extra drawer and i've got another four one go higher so mount lawson is growing so there's no reason to look at these that's all that is and i just get a variety of different well i guess i'll show you a few Sometimes I forget what I This one's a 16 small bin and a long one. Set that down there. This one's a open. Oh, this one's flashing some. I did not know that. Let's see what's in you. Hmm. And that happens with these. They put the boxes up for bid. The manufacturer. A lot of their specialty boxes, like my drill indexes and stuff from Lawson, a lot they're all made by Hewitt. Sometimes it's little feature changes. It's an awesome flash. Well, it's one of these. And that's cool as a latch, so. Okay. These are just blank sheets. That they send you with them. I guess that's all I said. Move you down. Let's go to my actual order. Sorry, doing stuff around. Got a lot of the shop clean in preparation for Saturday's addition to the shop. So. Rip tape. Rip. Let's see what we got in here. Uh, I have no idea what's in here. So I don't remember ordering any assortments. Oh, yeah, I did. Yeah, sorry. This is a socket head. These are the uh, cut point socket head cap screws. I have some of the pointed ones, but I don't like to <coughs> use those on certain things, of course, where the shafts get damaged. 
Let's order some of those. Because there. Order day. I wash things. Okay. I want to do a video here. I just bought a bunch of safety stuff. Fire extinguishers, first aid kits, a couple of these. I'm going to do a whole video on a shop safety, which I think is a lot of things a lot of people overlook in smaller shops. So that'll be a video coming up. Another one was a coarse thread. So this one should probably be, yeah. One was pipe, one was fine thread. This one's a, uh, or coarse thread, this one's fine thread. So there we go. Cool. Now I'm set on set screws for the rest of my life. Order one thing. Bead silver is coming from someplace else. So it's everything in here but one thing. Okay. I've had a bunch of people ask me to get to do tire repair. So I bought a lot of tools for that. This is a stem puller. This is the tire cement for the plugs. This is a different tire cement. I know I ordered two different kinds. Yep, but exactly. Here's the little gun or handle thing for pulling the plugs through. Narrow repair string. This is what goes in the in the holes of the tire. So tire, this is for you know reaming it out and cleaning it. Another tire tool. This is a different, slightly different one. This is the fat tire stuff. Let's see if we can get this guy open. So what I like to do is I kind of shotgun it and just get I like to get all the stuff I need at once. I don't know if I'm gonna start stocking tubes because I don't like to have money sitting in stuff. Oh, this stuff is pretty, pretty cheap. So there's the bigger ones. There's some instructions. Okay, what else did I get? Four gauge. And then I got a bunch of stuff for making battery cables to expand my battery capable making capability. These are more solder slugs for one op wire. So I do make a lot of battery cables for people. That's what these are. These are four gauge, two gauge. Same stuff. Is that it? That is it. So yeah, all this stuff, like I mentioned before, I like to have the stuff, so if someone calls me on a Monday night at 8 o'clock. They need a cable made, you know, have a flat tire and stuff. I like to keep, that's what all this is for. All the money I've spent on this stuff is for stuff like that. So, I'm ever growing my expansion or ever growing my capabilities. So, what I do is I order these empty ones. I make my own backing sheets and put them in there. So, they're all nice and organized. Plus, this stuff is, I cannot tell you how handy it is to have all the stuff in the shop, so. So, I bring along with that, why I'm working on the uh, stuff with the phase converter, because I want to get that done tomorrow if I can. So, yeah, that's tonight's little video I'm bringing you along with. This is Adam from Small Town Machine Shop. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.